Tuhan, kita akan mendengarkan beberapa pesan dari Bapak Gubernur, Bapak Lukas NMB, dan Mama akan mendampingi sekali lagi. Kami undang dengan hormat untuk datang ke tempat ini, untuk maju ke depan. Kita sambut Bapak dengan Mama dengan tepuk tangan. Ayo. Bapak Pitong dan Bapak Emi yang menyediakan tempat ini. Ya. Terima kasih untuk tim tim Gubernur Bapak Karunga, semua tim yang bekerja untuk kita punya acara sampai tanggal 26. Ini selesai sebentar ini sudah selesai. Tinggal mereka. Ada anak-anak mereka yang mau ke perlaman, mereka ke perlaman mungkin satu dua hari, tanggal dua puluh delapan dan dua puluh sembilan. Ya, jadi kita mau tugas di di Jepura hari ini selesai. Ya, perayaan Natal dua puluh lima Desember dan dua puluh enam kita sudah selesaikan. Untuk itu saya menyampaikan terima kasih semua tim yang bekerja pada kedatangan tamu kita maupun sampai hari ini. Saya ingin menyampaikan ya mungkin ya the governor just expresses deepest appreciation to Bapak Emi. Bisa Bapak Emi, can you please stand up? Bisa begit berdiri. He's the man that you met at the airport. Okay. And then Bapak Terungga, yeah. You, you, he's always so the governor and and the team and Bapak Piton, can you please stand up? Okay. He's the owner. Yeah. So the governor is expressing his deepest appreciation for the team that work hard. And the Christmas celebration was yesterday, and today is the last day of the celebration, and. Uh, hopefully tomorrow there are there will be some of you that will be flying into the interior. Yeah, ada di sekalian yang semua hadir ini saya menyampaikan terima kasih semua hari hari kita yang datang dari apa dari seluruh Papua yang masuk di tempat ini kita sebentar yang menikmati hiburan. Terima kasih banyak orang menyanyi dan acara selesai kita buat. Yeah. So, thank you to all my brothers and sisters that have come to this place. Today is a day of of singing and celebration. So today there's nothing, there's no pressure, there's no no nothing. Just we come together, we sing. If you guys want to sing, you can come also and sing. Mungkin saya ada dengan Pak Pak Tewen, Tewen ni belum ada. Tewen, Tewen, ya, Tewen, 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 Tewen di mana? Steven, can you stand up please? Ya, sebentar akan dia kasih tahu, karena ya beli apa? Saya baru tahu karena mama saya dulu bilang lahir sama-sama dan dia punya adik. Ya. Yeah, because the governor's mother told him that he was born the same day with your younger brother Andrew. Yeah. <laughs> so all these years he used the wrong birth date because he didn't know when he was, was born. But today is a historical moment for him because today Stephen you will tell him when he was actually born. 
So today, um, Stephen, you will come and you will, uh, you know, explain about the the, the birth issue, and then his uh, young uh, elder sister is also here and she knows a little bit about that. But the most important thing today that the governor is going to do is, uh, on behalf of uh, our our older people, our parents, we would like to to apologize, yeah, to say say sorry, to repent for. Uh, on behalf of our parents for what they've done to to your your parents when they when they came in they, there was challenges they fought back and today the governor on, and his wife on behalf of the people of Papua they would like to say sorry they would like to apologize for what the, their parents have done <laughs> Di 5 Februari di tahun 1855, Injil masuk di Papua di Mansina. Ya, Otto Regesler. Ya, jadi kita kadang cerita Otto Regesler tidak memberkati orang Papua. Ya, tangannya mungkin diberkati, tapi kita orang Papua tidak memberkati. Beda dengan di Sumatera Utara memensen datang memberkati orangnya jadi orang Batak minta akan ada pemberkatan dari Pak Mumensen karena dia tidak memberkati nah ini juga terjadi di Papua oleh karena itu ya saya pikir kesempatan mereka datang kita menyampaikan permohonan maaf pada banyak misionari yang mati mati saya karena pengintilan ya salah satunya adalah uh, mereka tidak datang tapi bulan Oktober, uh, November sedang gini di pokok ini mereka akan datang yaitu mati di Lembasen ya di dunia ya ini ini kami ingin minta maaf pada anak-anak anak-anak yang hari ini orang tua kita mungkin waktu itu mereka bawa ini apa tidak tahu mereka belum tahu ini misionari sudah bawa berita tentang kebenaran dan keselamatan tapi orang tua kita kan tidak ketidaktahuan itu malah membunuh mereka dan itu sebagai sejarah yang pahit untuk kami orang Papua ya itu yang kami sampaikan permohonan maaf yang sebesar besarnya dari masyarakat Papua para mas, para misionaris dan lain di seluruh tanah Papua. Yeah, um, because uh, the, 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 your parents, there were two missionaries that were killed in Seng Valley, and uh, that is something that has to be re reconciled, and that what that's what the governor wants to do today. When they came in, and they were killed there, and that is something. Um, there are two, the first the two missionaries from uh, from from uh, the ne Netherlands. Uh, they came in from, from Germany, they came in to the Mansinam Island in uh, uh, February 5th, 1855. Uh, their name is Otto and Geisler. And when they came to Papua, they blessed this land. So the land of Papua is very rich, but they didn't bless the people of Papua. 
Uh, on the other hand, the, a missionary called Nomensen, he went into North Sumatra, and when he went there, he blessed the people. So the Batak people are, are very clever, and they have power now in, in, in Indonesia. And that's why the governor said, we have to reconcile, we have to repent, we have to say sorry to you, so that you can release blessings uh, on, the, on the people of Papua. Uh, these two uh, missionaries, uh, Philip Master and Stanley Gale, their uh, children, I think, they will come next year on November on the annual uh, conference of uh, Gidi in Pokondini. Ya, saya ingin sampaikan terima kasih apa kunjungan bapak bapak di Papua. Ya, ini adalah negeri negeri yang bapak bapak buka sekarang sudah terbuka untuk semua orang bisa datang. Dulu mungkin belum bisa orang bisa masuk sini, tapi karena bapak bapak di sana membuka ini. Negeri ini bisa terbuka Banyak anak-anak Papua yang berhasil Sudi di berbagai tempat di dalam atau luar negeri Membuahkan hasil dan luar biasa Atas karya-karya yang dibuat oleh Pak Misionaris Kami menyampaikan terima kasih untuk itu Ya So, the governor is saying thank you Because this land was very, it was dark and it was closed But the missionaries came and they opened it this land and this land is now open and it, uh, and it is it is blessed and uh, it is now open for many people they are coming in and also God has blessed the, the students of Papua many students of Papua they are very bright uh, students and they are now going to, to, to college and they are going to schools in Indonesia and also abroad Ya, sehingga hari ini kami atas nama seluruh masyarakat Papua, seluruh rakyat seluruh rakyat di Papua menyampaikan selamat datang di tanah ini dan Pak Komisionaris kami menyampaikan juga permohonan maaf yang sebesar-besarnya dua kilo orang tua kami yang sudah meninggal dan anak-anak anak-anak dan beberapa orang tua kami semua sudah ada. Yeah. So on behalf of uh, the Papuan people and our our parents, uh, I would like to apologize. I would like to say, please forgive us for what we've done to your parents when you uh, when they first came here. There are many missionaries that. That, that they uh, they experience many uh, uh, rejection and uh, bitterness from the people. So he is saying the governor is standing here on and with his wife on behalf of the people. We would say, please forgive us. Yeah. <laughs> Dan seterusnya, hari ini kita bisa lakukan Waksudnya istirahat, kita kembali ke Jayapura Oke okay. Ya, yeah, jadi, eh, sorry So today is a day of singing It's a day of entertainment After that, we will eat And then we will go back to Jayapura Have a nice day, everybody okay. Have a nice day Bye.